The Russian region of Tuva, sometimes referred to as the Siberian Shangri-La, it is both remote and mysterious. Tuva is located in the north of Mongolia and surrounded by mountains. After centuries of isolation, Tuva is now being exploded by the rest of the world. Tuva, a republic of the Russian Federation, is one of the world's richest archaeological finds. It has a population of 300,000 people who historically led a nomadic way of life, making them capable horsemen. Locals also call Tuva the Valley of the Tsars, a large plain where hundreds of ancient burial mounds dating back to the Scythian era have been found. In 2001, Russian archaeologists found more than 1,000 pieces of gold and bronze jewelry and other items in a grave in the southern Siberian region, which has been named Arjan II. This land has been given the status of a sacred Tuvan land. Here our ancestors, the Thesian, lived. Their high culture raises the spirit of the Tuvan people to the same level as that of the Scythians. Unlike most burial mounds made of earth, Arjan II was made entirely of stone. Standing two meters high and 80 meters across, it was a crown of thousands of tons of rock. Recently, a small museum exhibition opened on the edge of Arjan II, revealing some of the treasures found in the graves. In all, some 20 different graves have been discovered for men, women, children, and warriors, as well as a common horse grave with 14 skeletons. Although the Tuvans have long been fascinated by their own history, it is only recently that the archaeological digs have taken place. Our people are very interested in our history, but archaeology is little studied in Tuva. The thorough study of the Tuvan Kurgans began only some 20 years ago. In celebration of the opening of the Arjan II Museum, a day of traditional Tuvan sports was held in the valley. While the race takes place, women set about preparing traditional Tuvan dishes in which meat is king. After the race was over, men marched out onto the field to take part in Quresh wrestling. This is traditional Tuvan sport, Quresh uh, wrestling. It's uh, where uh, this uh, costume, the uh, men, they grab hold of each other and uh, try to make each other go to the ground. You can't touch, only can touch the ground with your feet. And if you touch with anything else, you lose. Beautiful country. It's a country of proud people who live off the land. And there are not so many of those left in the world. So we have to do everything we can, you know, to help the people who still do protect it. After centuries of isolation, Tuva and its culture and customs are being discovered by foreigners. Perhaps because it has been isolated both geographically and politically for so long, Tuva has managed to preserve its culture and history. TITV Weekly.